Duolingo is back with yet another language course for the girlies. With some absolutely unparalleled promotional material from the Duolingo interns, music was announced along with an integrated math course. Instead of being on separate apps, both would be added straight to Duolingo proper as language courses. They've both finally landed in my account, so today we're going to go ahead and take a look. Can music measure up to the excellence of the other Duolingo courses? Let's find out! So let's start with a little bit of background. I was in band in middle school and high school, where I played the trumpet, and then I graduated to the mellophone when I was in marching band. I wasn't a very dedicated band kid, but alas, I was still a band kid. So I think I have a little bit of knowledge about music. I think that I should be able to pass Duolingo music with flying colors. So let's get into it. So welcome back to Duolingo. Yay, I love this app. I guess it's been a while since we've been in the actual Duolingo app because we were doing Duolingo ABC and then we did Duolingo math. But the important thing here is that math and music are no longer separate apps. Instead, they're right here. And if we click on math, all of our progress from the math app has been transferred to normal Duolingo. I'm kind of upset because I liked the math app layout better than the Candy Crush situation happening here. Um, I actually still have the math app installed. You can't install that anymore. So I feel like if I sell my phone right now, I can make like a, a crap load of money. The net worth of my phone has increased by 500% just by owning Duolingo math. Okay, but let's get into music. Here's a closer look at the music course. Thank you, Duo. Why is Duo holding a pencil and clipboard? I don't like when he holds objects, it bothers me. Let's start at the very beginning. Skip to harder lessons anytime. I say we do a placement test. Is there a way to do a placement test? Cause that's what we need to do. Play the note C. Okay. Play the note C. C, 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 C. Drag the note to the key. I guess we're learning piano. Good. Play the note D. Okay. Ah, rhythm, my speciality. Whoa, 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 okay, hold on. We have jumped ahead. There's a treble clef, there's a time signature, there's quarter notes. What if I knew nothing about music? What if I didn't know anything about how to read this? Hold to play the beat. Oh, I don't like this. I don't know how I feel about this. Ads, ads. How do I jump ahead? I'm gonna jump to the hardest one. Pass this test to jump to unit 69. Great, what a great number. All right, let's go. Drag to the note A. Are we in bass clef? Are we in treble clef? Are we in the violin clef that I can't remember the name of? A. Arrange from low to high pitch. A, B. This doesn't make sense. Oh wait, does it play it? Okay, so D's first. I guess it's this way. What am I supposed to do here? Wait. Oh, we have to listen. Okay. I guessed. I just guessed. Is the arrow, does that mean octave? But there's no C octave here. C, D, E, F, G, A, B. That's F. I guess that's C. F, G. Now we're up above the staff. Hold on, I, I have to count them. I need the little like face note. You know when you're like learning how to read music and you learn face for the spaces? Yeah. F, A, C, E, F, G. And I think that's an A flat, right? B. E. Hey, I said G. My fingers are too fat for this. <laughs> I keep pressing the wrong note. <laughs> okay, and then A flat. Now I'm worried, now I'm afraid. I'm just gonna press A flat. Okay. Yes, we did it. E, D, C, B flat. Okay, I think it's C. Do you think it's C? Put the answer in the comments below. Yay! Drag the note to the key. Um, E, A. What? You didn't unlock unit 69? Okay. Unacceptable. Unacceptable. It's because I couldn't pay attention. This was too boring for me. <laughs> Watch as I make every excuse ever. Okay, again, again. I passed level 69. <laughs> yes, 
Ooh, a Chevy truck. Sponsor me, Chevrolet. Hold on, does that mean I unlocked everything else? Oh, okay, okay, okay. So now that we've unlocked everything else, we can get into playing actual songs. Okay, what's the first song that you learn on the app? Hot Cross Buns, wow, a classic. Give it up for Hot Cross Buns. Oh, oh my goodness. Oh, oh. I have to hold down the note? Why is there like an accompaniment? I can't even hear myself. I thought this was supposed to be a solo. Okay, hot cross buns, easy, too easy. Mary had a little lamb, oh, oh please. We can do this. Combo lost, no. Little lamb. I'm harmonizing. Why was that? Why did I not get three stars? Hold on. <laughs> uh, let's, let's take two. Let's do that again. Slay. snow yeah that's what this app is missing like the the just dance combo noise so they said they had 200 songs let's see what the best song they have is trumpet voluntary no idea ode to joy classic simple gifts are there like original duolingo songs no way blue Danube waltz let's just go to the end battle him the republic guys this is unironically a good song. This slaps. I am Abe's biggest fan. This is for all the MC Parkers out there. This may be too difficult for us. Well, I guess we know how the song goes. We can do it. We can do it. Okay. How am I supposed to do this with one finger? I- oh. This is not- this is not happening. So let's pretend um, that didn't happen. Let's go to something slightly easier, you know, just a little bit easier. Not that that wasn't easy because <laughs> it was for someone as skilled as I am, but um, mm, let's let's try something else. Grand Old Duke of York, sure. I don't know what this is, but let's do it. Okay, a banger. What? Yes. I'm just gonna press C. Yes. This is exactly how the game is supposed to be played. Yep, yep. How did I get pitch 60% and rhythm 81% when I didn't play like half of the notes? Here's Ode to Joy again. Ode to Joy is like the easiest song ever. Uh-huh. So easy. Rhythm 99%, ha ha ha. I feel like this is a good level for us. Let's try this other one. Ah, the Star Spangled Banner. Good, perfect, start. What it, what? Hold on, wait, 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 wait. Let's, let's try that again. Okay, da da da. G. Just kidding, I'm just gonna play E. Why are we playing like a harmony part? Why are we not playing the main? What was that? What was that? Kind of upsettingly, I'm getting better at hitting the notes, but like the keyboard situation is not great. It's not like playing a real piano where you can feel the keys so you know where you are. This is just, I don't know. This is near impossible. <laughs> You'd have to really practice this app to get here. Like, this is like a rhythm game. 
It's less like playing a real piano, more like doing a rhythm game. Also, it changes the location of where all the notes are every single song you play. So like, if you get used to one keyboard, then you don't learn the rest of them. I don't know. Or maybe I'm just getting better because I'm going backwards. Let me start going forwards instead of backwards. I'll do the C U shanty. Let's go. Pirates on a boat, 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 boat. Oh, it's Drunken Sailor. Sea Shanty kind of failed that one. At this point, I was kind of getting the hang of things, but I couldn't stop thinking about it. I needed to redeem myself. I would conquer Battle Hymn of the Republic if it was the last thing that I did on this godforsaken app. I knew that in order to face my adversary, I needed to improve. Train harder. Train faster. It's time to show what I've learned on Duolingo Music. The grand finale. It is time for Battle Hymn of the Republic. Why did I do that voice? Sorry. Anyways. Okay, let's go. What? I didn't get two stars. Clearly, I've kind of hit my skill cap. I don't think that I can do better than what I'm doing currently, unless I practice this like religiously. But like the keyboard keeps moving. The keys that you're using keep changing around. So even if you memorize the locations, it's different for every song. I don't know, you'd have to play like the same song 10 million times, which I'm not willing to do. Sorry, Duolingo. So I guess that was Duolingo music. Yay. You know what? This has kind of ignited a spark in me. Give me a second here. Five bucks says this won't even pick up on the mic. So in conclusion, what did I think of Duolingo Music? It was difficult. Way more difficult than I thought it was gonna be. But they did pretty good for what they were given. I mean, it's hard to teach people how to play piano, I guess, on an app, especially with the whole keyboard limitations. I feel like without an actual piano, you're not gonna learn anything. You might learn how to like read music from the app, which is pretty good, but that's about it. So thank you all for joining me today and have a great day, everybody. Bye bye. Ow, that was so difficult. Okay.